Hello everyone, my name is Mia and I'm from the Sun City Library. In today's video, I will show you how to make a felt flower bookmark. The supplies you will need are listed down below and can also be found in the description box. Okay, let's start. First, cut out the pattern and use this pattern to cut out the felt. You can pin the pattern onto the felt or hold it down securely with your fingers. Before we sew the flower petals together, sew on the button or the circular felt you have cut out. I've decided to use the circular felt to put in the center of the petals. Poke your needle up from the yellow felt a little bit away from the edge. And when you poke the needle back down, do it where the yellow and blue felt meet. This keeps the stitch neat and subtle. Do it all around the yellow felt. When you're done, flip it to the back and anchor it to the nearest stitch. Knot it twice for security and cut the excess. Put the ribbon in between the two petal sheets. Keep the size of the ribbon in mind before you start to stitch. You don't want to close the opening without the ribbon in. Here I am using the blanket stitch, but you can use any stitch you like. When I get to the V between two petals, I like to stitch this area twice so that the thread remains close to the felt. This is up to your preference because double stitching this area makes it a little harder to redo the stitches if you'd like to go back. Before stitching up the entire flower, remember to insert the ribbon. I'm going to use a running stitch to secure it.
When you reach the end of the ribbon, continue with the blanket stitch. Once you have reached the end, poke the needle through the first stitch you've made and tie it off. Weave your needle through the other stitches before poking it through the felt. Cut off the excess. Now we're going to blanket stitch the pot at the end of the ribbon. Once you're done, your flower bookmarks may look like this. I hope you all like this project. If you'd like to join Monthly Craft Club's live virtual Zoom meetings, you can sign down below in the description box. If you'd like to know more about our projects and programs, please consider following our social media. We hope you liked this video and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!